That's a common feeling when casting a lure on Lower White Oak Lake. Situated about 15 miles northwest of Camden, Lower White Oak has a new lease on life thanks to the Arkansas Game and Fish Commission's renovation of the nearly 60-year-old lake. When a lake is first built, it's, that's the most fertile it's ever going to be. We learned about the phenomenon known as New Lake Effect from Jason Olive, an assistant chief of fisheries for the Game and Fish Commission and an avid bass angler. You got all this nice cover, newly flooded cover, you have all these nutrients coming out of the soil, and so it's really productive, fish grow really fast, and then you lose that after about 10, 15 years. So uh, renovating lakes gives us an opportunity to set the clock back. Um, the, the nutrients in the soils, uh, you kind of get a, a, a release of nutrients after you reflood the lake. Uh, and also while it's down, we're able to go in and do a lot of habitat work uh, with adding woody debris and piling stuff up, uh, making brush piles, various fish attractors. And uh, so the lake fills back up, you have a new influx of nutrients, newly flooded cover again, and uh, it's just like it was when it was first built. So then we get another 10 or 15 years of that boom uh, that we wouldn't have gotten had we not renovated the lake. It's hard to argue with results like these. There's one. There he is. Not a bad nice. fish. Yeah. Don't go in that stump. Wake up. Speed crawl? Yep, speed crawl. I'd say that's one of our original stockers from 2013. Healthy looking. Yeah, yeah, he looks good. Broken infrastructure forced Game and Fish to drain the lake in 2012, but it also gave fisheries managers the chance to embark on a two-year project to improve fishing. So when we drained this lake in 2012, we had just had about three years of drought. And so there were a lot of freshly dead, large hardwood trees along the edge of the lake. And the ones that weren't already dead pulling the lake down, you know, kind of finished them off, I think. But anyway, we had a lot of, uh, a lot of timber to work with, and so we had tractors out here and uh, stacked these things up. I mean, there's about a hundred of them out there, about the size of a, each of them about the size of a semi-truck. Large brush piles were just the beginning. Game and Fish teams also used several tons of gravel to create five spawning beds, ranging from 1,200 to 2,000 square feet in size. Crews also built several large rock piles and more than two dozen catfish clubhouses. More than 1,100 tons of lime was applied to boost the lake's fertility. The renovation also has benefited the lake's shoreline habitat. Before the renovation, there was no uh, cover around the banks on this lake. Really? Yeah. I mean, it was just barren. And uh, since then, we had some vegetation come up. I mean, there was a lot of grass carp in here before. And after we drained it, we got rid of the grass carp. So we got some vegetation coming on. Then we cut a lot of trees along the shoreline and hinged them over into the lake. And then some of this other stuff just floating, you know, stuff that floated up off the lake bottom and was blown up uh, against the bank as the lake was refilling. And so that makes a lot of nice cover too. But uh, yeah, it's, it's a totally different lake than it was before. The lake was restocked with sport fish, including Florida strain largemouth bass. But perhaps more important, it got an infusion of bait fish. We stocked a ton of, of threadfin shad when this thing first started filling back up. And they had really an entire season to uh, spawn without any predators uh, being in there to, to knock their numbers down. So. It really, it really worked out well establishing the forage base. Four years removed from the renovation, Lower White Oak Lake is showing big promise. Right down in some stuff. Yeah, but... 
About the same size as that first one this morning. They all do look healthy, man. I mean, they're just good looking fish. Yeah, they are. You can't turn back the clock, but when it comes to improving a fishery, you can definitely get back closer to the salad days through lake renovation. healthy fat fish. About the same size as the other two. 